have you. Hey guys, look cool. Mr. Birch here. I'm with my <laughs> wife. No. She's making a video with me. We love each other. We never fight during this quarantine, do we? Never. No. How's it going, guys, at home? For real, though. Um, Mr. Birch misses you all. Hey, to be fair, I did put out a polo, though, today. <laughs> um, but I am still wearing sweatpants. I can confirm that. <sighs> yeah. Can you see my wife's jeans, by the way? She's got holes in her jeans. Now, you bought those like that? You bought those jeans? I'm out of here. All right. All right. I love you, honey. Okay. But for real, though, we're making a video from the sun porch. It's actually not that warm out here. It's, um, it's freezing. But uh, we could really use a break in the Wisconsin weather, I think. Okay. Good. All right. So anyway, wanted to talk to you guys a little bit about um, art. Um, the, the stuff that's been coming in is fantastic. Let me know if you're struggling with any of the uh, turning in process thing on Google Classroom. I, it probably looks different from the Chromebook. I know we've used iPads to turn things in um, in the past. So if you're running into any trouble turning things in, make sure you reach out to me. Shoot me an email, whatever you got to do um, so that I can help you because I'm here for you. Okay, so let's remember that. Um, the next project that I have in mind is I would really love to um, do something with public art. I just feel like Cabin Fever has got people out and walking around like I've never seen before. You'll see two uh, neighbors that have never spoken to each other and they will be standing 20 feet apart from each other having a conversation they've never had before. Um, my wife and I, we were on a walk and we've seen all this cool sidewalk chalk stuff. Uh, we've seen windows that are decorated. So I'd like to get in on this. So <clears throat> I have three ideas. One of them is a window project where you're going to uh, decorate your window, try and spread joy somehow to people that are walking by by decorating your window. Another thing is to do sidewalk chalk. And my first thought was to do your own driveway or your own sidewalk. But then I saw some, some kids that were doing some cool stuff in my neighborhood where they would actually go over to their friend's house. Now they can't play, but they can still make a chalk art for their friends. And I thought, wow, that is powerful stuff. And the third one is for the kids that don't wanna do the window and maybe don't have chalk, would be just to make a cool poster. So if you got a cool poster idea, something on, we'll get through this, we're all in this together, you know, um, or just an uplifting message, I think that would be great too. So I'm going to do what I did last week. I'm going to put a presentation in Google Classroom, explain some of the ideas a little bit more. Hopefully you can find something to get inspired. Remember that we don't have access to the same materials. So part of it is just going to be working with what you have. And I'll tell you this, artists do this every day. Okay. So you need to work with what you have and uh, find a way to find your voice and express yourself. Look, I know this is not ideal, but I really do believe that we are doing projects that we could never do before. We need to take advantage of this opportunity and uh, make things from our homes as opposed to me giving you materials and, and uh, project ideas. This is, this is cool, this is exciting. It, I'm having a blast, I mean, in a different way, okay? So I hope that you can find that too. And I'm excited to see what this week brings. Okay guys, stay healthy, stay safe. I love you.